champion last season, co-champion if you will, coming back from being a champion, hopefully we uh, repeat that, y'all love me don't you? Eh, yeah, probably not. I'm here to compete again since last time I went out first, very depressing, I know how the competitors in the Vicious Challenge feel now, nothing to do all day because I had the whole day planned for Vicious Challenge and I lost. Hopefully this time I do better, I'll have a partner, because I think last time I just went too crazy. If I would have had someone there to calm me down and say, hey, take your time, think about it, I would have been alright. So this time I'm going to try working on more focus, more than going all out. Hey, it's uh, Ryan, Ryan Berg. I'm glad to be back, actually. I was here at the beginning of Season 4. Black team, my mama, made me go home after the first mission. I was pretty pissed. I got, I got another chance with Brandon, and we'll tear it up today, because... Have you seen what he's wearing? <laughs> uh, hey, I'm Brandon Dallas, and I was in the third season. David Garfield guy kicked my ass, I guess. But today, Ryan's my partner. I'm pretty confident about that. You know, I play football with him, some of my teammates, and I'm pretty sure we're just tear up. I mean, look at him, look how focused he is. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm pretty sure that we're going to do pretty good. Season 5, I was supposed to be in there, um, I kind of overslept, got really fucked up the night before, but I'm here today, uh, supposed to be Wyatt's partner, but kind of started talking, and, and I was like, oh, I'll be David's partner, because I really want to win, so. David Garfield here, Season 6, I'm supposed to be in Season 5, but I forgot, I slept in, like an idiot. Cameron thinks he's cool, because he won with Matt Folds, and he should have went. I split up and fought for the thing, but he's a pussy. So last season was kind of fun because it was all chance, not much physical stuff. But this season, I don't think it really matters how it is. Me and Matt will probably clean the table either way, so I guess we'll just see what happens. Oh, my name's Patrick Scharf. Um, he's meant to win, pretty much. I'm Steven Scharf. Uh, Probably gonna be the winner of this one this season. We do the exact same things. We both play football, both lift weights, both gonna dominate this season. Uh, Cisco, he likes to run his mouth. I don't think he'll be running it at the end. Especially Cisco, hate him. Football bag. <laughs> Keep throwing it. <laughs> Well, uh, I just turned 21 today, so I'm going to the bar again and I was there last night. As far as being Cameron's partner, I think he's kind of gay. I'm glad he took out them little pierced earrings he had. I don't know if y'all seen those or not, but uh, yeah. Um, I really don't know the teams, but I don't think there'll be too much competition here for us. I'm, I'm hoping to get him the first three-time champion for your show, so you know, we'll see what we can do. My name's Amber. Uh, I'm partners with Savannah. Me and her both have some court fines to pay, so hopefully we'll get a little bit of money. Savannah's my best friend, I love her, but she might be laughing at every competition and not trying at all. I've never been here before, so I don't know about the other competition, so hopefully we can win some money. I'm Savannah. I'd rather be at the beach today because it's really hot out here. Um, I was supposed to be partners with Patrick, but I ditched him for Amber, so we'll see what's going to happen. Me and Amber could definitely use the money, so oh. we'll see what happens. I'm feeling good today. I'm a little hungover. Uh, Got a lot of drinks in me last night. I'm hoping there's no Hawaiian punch involved because I've had enough of that in the vicious challenge. I think it's gonna be fun anyway. Hey kids, welcome to season six of the challenge. Today we are going to have a partners challenge. That means each of you has your own partner, duos, if you if you will. Like, let me just give you an example. Jamie and David are together. Cameron and Matt Deppenball are together. The first mission, guys is going to be an obstacle course. If you're a team of two, we'll start down at the end of the road. You're going to run from this block to my car. Each of you will have to go in the front window, one by one, to get on the other side of the, the car. On the other side of the car, there are half gallons of Hawaiian punch. 
Each one of you will have to drink your own. We'll run up the stairs, and you'll go down the twisty slide. You'll run from that play place to the picnic tables. So if you get to the picnic table, and your partner's right here, you got to wait for them. You can't just take off and keep going through the obstacle course. You'll run to the play place again, run up the twisty slide, run back to the car, go through the front doors again, crawl through the car, and then run back to where you started. The fastest time will get your team 20 bucks. That's $10 for each person, and they will be safe from elimination. Let's do it. Friends of the car, Tony was going to go through the window first. Okay, me and Savannah took off, and Savannah said, don't run that fast, run with me. And then I kicked Savannah in the face right whenever I was getting out. I went to try to push him through to get him to go faster, and I like, messed up my thumb a little bit. We started out too quick to get to the car. Like, we started chugging, and I'm out of breath already, and I'm trying to put it down. The running car, it sucks. Me and my brother had a strategy, we're going to jog, because we saw everybody drinking the punch was getting tired. That all goes out the window when you crawl through that door. Fairly, fairly big kid, so I didn't think I was ever going to get out of that car. Got a little banged up there, and your, car, your car's kind of tiny. Got to the Hawaiian Punch, we chugged the shit out of it. We had to chug the Hawaiian Punch, and I felt like I was going to puke the whole time. <laughs> I got the chug down probably in about 15, 20 seconds. I thought sharps were gonna be really slow going through there, but looks like they kicked all of our asses. A lot faster than everybody else. Uh, Stephen and Patrick just kind of like one gulped those Hawaiian punch, just like. <laughs> well, I chugged it a lot faster than I thought I would. I kept up with Matt just like I tried. The sharps did it quickest, and I was like, well, as long as you can keep up with me, we'll be fine. <laughs> Down the slide, got to the picnic table. I was slowing down a lot because my stomach was completely full. I don't know what Brandon was thinking. He runs around the playground. I was just so confused, so I started running around. I was like, twisty slide. And I was like, yeah, I was like, shit, you know, I had to go back around. Run up the stairs, going down the slide was pretty easy. Again, I had to wait for Patrick. Hurry up! People may think I was going to throw up, but no, I just had a burp. It was just a bird. I went head first down the slide. I shouldn't have. It just slid me down a little bit. When we touched the picnic table, he starts throwing up. We both turned around, I was just like puking. It just kept coming up. Tasted of corn punching bananas. Come on, Brandon, let's go! Originally, I was gonna go through the car first, but Savannah wanted to go through first when we got there. We kind of talked about it in our slow run through. I got Hawaiian punch stuck right here. I'm not gonna puke. You can take it off me. Yeah, I wish I could throw up right now. It'd make me feel so much better. I think I'm good. Uh, I think we did pretty well. I think so. Oh yeah. Got this. I certainly don't think we got the slowest time since we didn't puke until after. Well, I didn't puke at all. Savannah didn't puke until the very end when we were already done.